Welcome to EPR UK. Today we're going to be having a look at the Manrose 4 inch fan. Uh, this particular model is the XF100T, which is the timer model. It's a class 2 fan and it's rated at 20 watts. So let's, uh, let's crack straight on. It's uh, a moulded plastic cover. And the fan itself comes complete with um, six fixing holes. So you've got two at the top, two in the middle, two at the bottom. Cable entry is via these slots at the bottom. And the strain relief here. Now the connector block is uh, just a 5 amp standard connector block. So trying to loop in and out of this um, if you wanted to do. Uh, I probably wouldn't advise it. But... Uh, be a bit little bit tight and if you were trying to get like a 1.5 in there again you'd have to be pretty pretty neat with your your terminations great thing about the fan on top we've got an increment timer 1 to 30 minutes and again uh, fantastic for ease of setup so that you can you can just turn the little pin dial round to the required number of minutes Obviously, in most bathroom installations or toilet installations, you're looking around 15 minutes of overrun. The fan is pretty robust, but uh, looking into the manual, it does say that if the surface of the um, the wall that it's to be applied to isn't straight and slight warping occurs, and it can interfere with the uh, the clearance of the actual blades in rotation. There's not a lot of room in there, as you can see. But overall, not a bad quality product. So, how do we uh, how do we supply it? Now, according to the instructions, this thing should be uh, supplied by a double pole fuse spur fitted with a three amp fuse. Now, if you have a look at BS seven six seven one, regulation one three four states that you should follow manufacturer's instructions. And if you don't, it's on your head, be it, if anything was to go wrong. So how do we go about fitting an inline uh, fuse to supply this particular unit? One solution that I've come up with is uh, this switch from, from Schneider. Um, this is a grid type system. And basically I've bought a two-way switch and a, uh, a fuse carrier. And basically I've mounted the two on, on a plate so that you don't have to mount a separate uh, fuse connection unit in a box. Schneider produced some excellent switches and sockets. Um, these particular ones have the feature of a, a loop in, loop out on the back of the switch. So you could run your live and neutral down here, loop everything through off the bathroom, and uh, you're, you're assured that you've got your, your three amp protection, and obviously put your, your fan isolator on as well. Both products are available from Edmondson Electrical. Um, the, the fan is priced at $16.97 plus VAT. And uh, like I say, they're widely available. It's a fairly decent product for the, for the quality and the price that you pay uh, for, a, for a budget product. Uh, it's capable of removing 85 meters uh, cube per hour of air change. And the, the maintenance issues uh, of what I've gathered over the last few years have been very very few um, obviously there's no serviceable parts in here if the fan was uh, first to develop a problem it would be an exchange of the unit but at that sort of cost it's uh, it's pretty reasonable anyway thanks for yeah uh, thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed the short video i'll uh, i'll catch up with you again soon